Sega. There we go. Ahoy, if you want to welcome aboard, I'll be a Captain Hillian tonight, along with... Peace of mind to return to Drakea at your service. And welcome back to Dawn of War 2 Retribution, where, well, we should be finishing up the campaign as the Orcs. And after that, we'll get started on the, <clears throat> the Space Marines <laughs> campaign, since, well, like I said, this was kind of their story to begin with. So it's just fair that we also finish with them. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but yeah, I, this goes also to show that this game is rather short if you don't do the optional stuff and such. Yeah. So yeah, if we wanted okay. to, we could go right for the finale, eh? but there are still some side missions that we can do. I feel like we should do that, actually. Okay. First off, though, let's look at some levels. Let's see. We have two levels to go, since 10 is, I believe, the maximum. So, let's see. Deep breath. <laughs> okay, I, I'm going for deep breath just because I want to see what the hell is up with that. <laughs> okay, nail brain. Uh, <laughs> let's go for this one here, because we have been using vehicles a bit. Uh, Spookums and Brickfists, well, they, they're now ahead in level, so there's no real need to. Okay, let's have a look at everyone's armor. 90, 50, 66, and 72. We've, been got, we've gotten a lot less war gear, but then again, that's also because this whole game is split between six factions. So, of the production, the production time for all of the war gear was also split between all factions. Yeah... And we did get some new. I just say, isn't that a special armor used for him? Uh, yeah, that's the the angry armor. Let's oh, right. see. Uh, wait, what? Oh, come on! <laughs> it's his it's his knife, but he needs another level before he can use it. Breakfast though can use this one, the head the Ed Turner. Okay. Does it actually do more damage? It deals less damage, but it's faster to attack. Uh and also the teleport on the warp stuff. <laughs> I kinda wanna see how that goes. Other than that. It, it, it also should make sense with ranged and melee. Spookums is going to stay as the anti-tank unit. Then again, Blood Flag has that claw, and Brickfist has the tank buster. So I think he actually deserves to get a different gun this time, just so he's not always logging around the same thing each time. And see, all of these have the same range. This one has the best accuracy, though. Hmm. Let's see, I don't think he needs time to set up anymore. And this one is just a normal... Yeah. Hmm. Okay, this one deals less damage, so it can be trashed. So, what do we... Do we go for something that attacks faster? But... Mm hmm. 
Uh, let's, give, let, let's give him the big gun. Okay. Well then, where do we start? Do we begin with Meridian, the Judgment of Carrion, or Typhonus Primaris, which has, well, gotten exterminated? Yeah, we want the optional one. Mm. We want to see the finale to last. I feel like we want the extra levels just for as good gear as possible and good levels as possible. <laughs> yeah. Though this also does show that you can't get all of the stuff that you'd want over here in the available forces. Yeah, so even so, more reason for us to do the side quests. Let's see. Let's begin with uh, this place. All right, boys. I was letting you in on this message I was picked up. But I get first pick of the loot when we strike. Got it? Containment bear. Hexman status. Notification. Initial quarantine designation. 3.5 centuries. Quarantine status. Completed. Cargo designation. Security level. Prime Earth. Value level. Prime Earth. Power level. Prime Earth. Dot dot. Contents erased. Label engine for cargo relocation. Operation. Advise. External containment bay breach. Xenos presence confirmed. Relocate cargo immediately. Well, that can't be any good. Okay, uh, let's see. Monstrous creatures without numbers repair the labor engine. Okay. The Tyranids will deploy massive ty uh, Tyrant Guards and even Carnifaxes. Make sure you have anti-armor weapons. The Tyranids will come in hordes and not always where you expect them. Labor engine can be repaired. Make sure you do because you only get one. I'm not sure Wait, if I've ever done this one before. Anti-armor. Yeah, since the Carnifaxes do count as vehicles here. Okay, so we need to put back the rocket launcher on uh, you know who. Probably for the best, yeah. Like, I believe... I, I think I said this before in Chaos Rising, uh, but the only the only Tyranid unit that counts as a vehicle and, and not infantry or heavy infantry is the Carnifax. Okay, here we go. Suppression, yeah. Use for slowing the advance of enemy infantry, particularly those that favor melee. Most suppression weapons must spend some, a few seconds setting up, so it's best to anticipate enemy movements. Yeah, and it makes them any unit that is... Yeah, I'm pretty sure... Uh, uh, anything that... Oh, hello. Anything that is suppressed also has their uh, damage basically nullified. They just came apart in the hands. Hmm, okay, this is a, a very small level, it looks like. Okay, but it is an escort mission, so it's a good thing that they keep it short, huh? Yeah. Also, let me actually f do something. I forgot to... Yeah, I forgot to rebalance the audio a bit, so let me move this up a little. Like, I think sev minus 7 decibels is going to be the perfect balance, where things are audible, but not too loud. Not, not too loud that it's, well, too loud on its own or overpowering. And I thought, it, I thought this thing was going to move on its own, but no, we need to control it. Oh, so we can take over there. Yep. You move aside for a moment. Yep. Just bent all of that down. Okay. Spookums, you capture that. No, not you. Infiltration detected. Yep. Ah, crap. Uh, well, time for that. Boom. Okay. Hey, what? Should you gather everyone on the same spot first? Probably best, yeah. 
Okay. Luckily, Flamer should do pretty well against these things. Okay, you lot go help. <laughs> okay, that's a line I've not heard clearly before. Okay, let's see if we can get some uh, reinforcements. That as well, yeah. Okay, some looters. Shoot us as well. If they can deal, they can set up and take care of any small fries like that. It's a bit odd that the the tyrannids on this place are are colored so oddly. Then, the, then the again, I guess they're trying to camouflage with well all of the rust. No, 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 no. It's a different color than you said for a different high fleet. So the big question is, which high fleet is this? Wait. Hold on. Have they been red with black corpus? Yes. Oh! Oh no! That's bad from the sounds of it. I fleet Kronos, the demon hunters. Okay, that also explains why they're in this hellhole. <laughs> yeah, they're not eat demons, but they have specialized in killing them. If I remember right. Okay. Uh, that way, because they're very clearly going to crawl through that. They're going to come from over there. This be Each of you cover one of those. You two get in the middle. Okay, that probably would have sounded a lot more ominous normally if it wasn't for the, the background no noise already. Thing that way. It's, it doesn't say a behemoth. Oh, strong with the then. The Python behemoth? Okay. I'm gonna have the double check. Very close was a big, 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 big color, but behemoth. I, I, oh, I did take a look at on the Dawn of War wiki recently to try and find out where the hell. Aurelia and Tartarus are. Uh, but all I could really find because was that they it's in the galactic uh, east. Like there is a map that has basically all of the planets and sector uh, all of the sectors on it. But there's literally hundreds of sectors on that so I could not find it if I if I wanted to probably. Oh and, dear. It did yeah, mark that there's that two. Yeah. Go ahead. Wait, that's it. That was saying. I think I think he was came from these. Yeah, the, the map did mark that at least two high fleets were active there. And yeah. <laughs> <laughs> them being red makes them look it makes the gene steers look like blood skeletons. Ooh, uh breakfast is getting a bit overwhelmed. Uh Spookums. Send him a present, please. You use the boom thing. I went for the nail brain. He has a thing that helps him to escape. There we go. Who was over there? Yep. It's breakfast to us up close. Oh, right. <laughs> good. That can't be good. <laughs> I 
knew it. Oh dear. Actually, I smelled something really recently. Hmm? There are beans in the orcs. Okay. I forgot what they call, but I'm never getting. They all look like free bloopers. They look like pirates and are being opposed to uh, the spread of uh, human infection. And they look disturbing. Ooh, that's no good. Yeah, you can see it find these little cults, not all of that are among humans. So I guess the human ones are the most common ones to see. Yeah. Only one I have the easiest time to hide with them. Oops might be as in the way I get in. It will be very quick on moving away from the What are you doing there? How do the looters go in <laughs> getting combat over there? Let me just keep that instead of some of the orc and dog. Yeah, we should get some more melee. No, actually, I think that's about done it. As I say that, I see more reds appear on the map. Okay, you lot cover to the entrance. Spookum's got up close to that one, so you can burn anything that mm. walks through. You two pull back. Coming. Okay, yeah. Get over there, one of you. Breakfast. Oh yeah, these are not... Okay, yeah, these are definitely the behemoths, but uh, I think if they had four blackened corpus, it could have been Kronos. Actually, you keep shooting at that, and Bug Zapper. <laughs> Take over here, you. And not storm boys. I think I think with Blood Flag they've basically found the perfect orc voice actor. That's your favorite one. Okay, back to back. Okay, gotta move on. Resource crate. Okay, the thing is still in good health. Practically yeah. unscratched, actually. Okay. Yeah. Let's find some melee to be gonna need it. Yeah. And that's that. Okay. That's right. it Deal with those. Okay. Yeah, they can take care of protecting the Lutas. And since there will be plenty of Tyranids to smack, keep getting your hammers. Okay. Lead the way. Oh, that's the act. Okay. Get the hell out. I don't okay. know. I'll have a good force in case there comes a final wave. This boy says we can't hit him, boss. See? You won't stay. Okay, one last attack. I I bloody do it. <laughs> okay, breakfast getting close. Okay. 
Okay, mobs. Hold the forts. Smoke grenade here. Wrong grenade. <laughs> it was a stun bomb. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> it's not like he labels these for what they are. Oh dear. that way. Uh, yeah, with good reason to. Nail brain, take that thing down. Are we in a scratch here? I'm gonna be yes, we are hurting it. Alright. Good boy. I don't expect to feel like you need to get your rocket launcher. Okay, I don't know what happened there, but I'm guessing all of his bombs went off all at once, uh, right on top of him. Oh, that one went down. Yep. Okay, so is the Carnifax, though. And he is back up. Okay. Okay, what's the objective now? <laughs> objective done. <laughs> I don't think okay. you would like on this beer, unless it was not as long as it's not made by the orcs. <laughs> uh, let's be honest, it's probably made from, made from orcs. And we got shiny scrap. <laughs> There'd be loots in this here bag again. And some of this was spooking. I meant as always was not made by the orcs. <laughs> not all. Well, I wouldn't. <laughs> I wouldn't be holding it against them from having it made from orcs as well. <laughs> uh, Let's see. Slap a chopper. Uh, use me slap and I'll use troubles away with the slap a chopper. <laughs> of course, they're hitting them with the blunt end. A max banner. Okay, a looted tank upgrades. Art and snazzy armor is the best uh, best of both worlds. Art and snazzy. <laughs> okay, a good amount. Yep. Yeah. Good defense yeah, and a health. bit of speed. Or was that. Or it at least gives health. Let's see. Tank armor. Plus five. Plus 75. No. 75 armor rating to all nearby allies and yeah chance to get healed on basically everything is made from a tank or is it made to protect you from a tank well first one then the other <laughs> okay upgrades for more death dread health or grants to frenzy ability which boosts damage rendering the squad invulnerable and grants immunity to suppression for the knobs i think we know which of those is better yeah dude the armor is also yeah and then again they're going to be somewhat split up most of the time we don't know how far those auras reach really true okay let's get you to your levels Let's see, what was I going again? Yep. Probably an orc that would taunt enemies while attacking him. <laughs> Load this temporarily as I go and prepare some food. I will keep my headphones on. Carefully up. Hmm. I, think I, I, go for... <laughs> I think I might go for. Think what I might go for targeting dummy because we can't really get the grappling hook anymore, since that would require, well, more levels than Spookums can get. We can only get to longer last time. <laughs> no. And we, we've never... <laughs> I don't think we've at any point had Spookums infiltrate, so there's no real need for that. 
Okay, more health, and while in cover, we'll slowly regain. Okay. Breakfast. You get your biggest jump. I kind of want to see if this actually does make him jump higher. <coughs> Anyways, now. <clears throat> uh, gain substantial experience. Get the looted tank upgrades. And, all right. We can, we can trade this in for some special armor, or no, not armor, arms. A huge weapon, a huge hammer for blood flag, rocket launcher for nail brain, breakfast gets a, a hammer as well, which is more defensive based, I'm guessing from that sub description. And Spookum's a special shooter, which I believe is their shot, yeah, that's their shotgun. We only, he only has that as his basic, we didn't find a single one of those. <clears throat> And let's just use this on Blood Flag so he gets leveled up. To level <laughs> to max level immediately, apparently. Okay. <coughs> okay, deep breath. And let's see. Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's just go fully that way then. Okay, so now he deals more damage as well. Now, who do we give this to, though? The shiny scrap for a new weapon. Anyone with low da with a low-level weapon? Level 5 power claw from the freaking beginning of the game? Yep. Though he can now use his own knife. <laughs> <coughs> uh, let's see. It actually deals more damage to heavy infantry, less to vehicles. Okay. Yeah, that's going to be good at either way, otherwise. You just have a level 6 flamer. You have that, but you can use... Let's see, is this any better for you? Uh, less damage? Hmm. Less damage, and it's melee damage resistance, but it doesn't have the teleport thing. <laughs> So, let's see, Choppa or Shooter for Spookums, or something for Nail Brains. Hmm, or, I, I keep calling him Nail Brains, but his name is Nail Brain. <coughs> now, let's wait until later on that. For now, though, let's see. Now let's li give a listen to this one at least. Boss, look here. Some other boys turned themselves a profit. What says we go turns it towards us? We found a power station, boss. Should give us the juice we need to finish her up. And why is you here telling me about it? I told you to find them and to guard them. Even if the humans don't come to take them back, someone else might come nick them. We're supposed to just sit on them power nodes and hope a scrap comes to us? Where's the fun in that? We only need them nodes long enough to finish building Daisy. That is when the fun begins. Okay. <coughs> when orcs start using cuddly names, that's when you know that something is up. <coughs> <clears throat> uh, let's see, war gear, real good huge hammer, <laughs> movement speeds, mm -hmm. it slows enemies for three seconds, storm boys upgrade, or an ability for the looted tank, bake shots, okay, that sounds good. Uh, diversify. The Orc Force includes suppression teams, melee jump troops, and armored vehicles. Counter them with a diverse squad and war gear loadout. Expect payback. Expect strong counterattacks after capturing a power node. Enemy Orcs will target foreign power generators. Okay. <coughs> mm, might as well take a look at the other one as well then. I snagged an Eldar's transmission! Sounds promising! Brothers and sisters, the human ships have carved large fissures into the world, some deep enough to cleave the buried craft world. 
We located the infinity circuit. The flames reach deep and every biodome, every soul stone, nothing remains for us here. All to report to the webway assembly. Once we return to the webway, we will collapse the channel to the craft world, sealing this tomb for eternity. I don't know what affinity circuit is, but I bet it's shiny! Mr. Nailbrain, gather the boys! Uh, of course. And, okay, we can get a knob leader here. Daisy? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and I also heard this about the Eldor that is concerning. Yeah, there was a craft world buried here all this time. So that explains what the fuck they, they were doing here, huh? Yeah. I forgot to go to my headphones so I can plug the torch back in. <coughs> okay. So either way, we can get an upgrade for the looted tank. Uh, let's see. Lucky like it's fit on your left hand too. A right splash go. power claw. <laughs> okay. So I which mission ready. shall we do then? So we go Ooh. loot a demolished craft uh, world, or shall we go see who or what Daisy is? Let's go see who the heck, what the heck Daisy is. I'm too <laughs> curious. Okay, here we go. Hmm. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. <laughs> and yes, there's an actual orc chant. Let's see, know your weapons. Weapons with high damage but low attack speed work well against bigger single targets. Weapons with low damage but high attack speed are best against swarms of weak enemies. Note the damage versus stats. This shows you how much of the, how much of the weapon's damage is applied to each unit type. It's... Oh, how? Why are we here? Boss, looks like a fire came to us after all. What? Well, keep them off the power notes. Daisy ain't ready yet. I spits on the banner of any other arc. They'll understand who's boss soon enough. <laughs> More victims. Oh, dear. Mm. And... <laughs> <laughs> he actually goes higher now. <laughs> okay. Land with explosion. Yep. Holy. <laughs> okay. okay, we need to use that power as much as possible. Hold on. Which man will be fighting against? <laughs> he goes so high we can't even hear him anymore. <laughs> Uh, bad moves, yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. Hmm? I think you. I think you. You just threw someone through a building into the deck. Okay. <laughs> Let's go deal with the weird boy first, then we go around to that power node, and then over there to that one. Okay, so there's no need for us to go after those. Okay. That way. Okay, breakfast, go introduce yourself. It's straight up into the fucking atmosphere. <laughs> uh. okay, get them out of there. Okay, incoming. <laughs> uh, that was freaking hilarious. Okay, Nailbrain, please get rid of that turret. 
Okay. And someone capture this. Okay. Yeah, easy enough so far. A long walk, boys, but worth it. Yep. Sorry, boy. Picked a bit too much. Okay, and moving on. <coughs> okay, I thought I thought there'd be a path from here to here, but I guess the marker covers it up a little bit. Oh well. <coughs> Breakfast. Just look in this here. Oh, the freaking idiots got stuck behind. Okay, eviction notice. It's too late for your little trick now. Actually, no. Just go give the weird boy a, a headache. A, a, spookums, the heck are you going? <laughs> okay. <laughs> I didn't expect that he would actually collapse buildings as well. Also, thank you for that. Yeah, let's t tell him to go into melee. Uh, he, he, there's no room to stand here. The slope is too big. Can I still stab him, though? No. Can I hit him with that? Yes, I can. Dead. <laughs> Grim Gubbins. Okay. <laughs> I'm guessing they just scraped whatever was left of them back. Get oh dear. Yep. Okay, that's going to lure a few of those out. Okay. Breakfast. <laughs> Would be hilarious if he lands face first. Okay. Grenades. Okay. Oh, hey there in chat, uh, pizza lover. Let's see, how are you? I'm good. Just gonna be looking at Love Your Tears look, by the way. They're <laughs> 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 yeah, doing well, I'd say. Doing uh, well, and thank you for the compliment. I'm almost tempted to keep this. Okay. This recharge is plenty quick now, it seems. I, I'm pretty sure it re took longer before. Ew. That sounds like incoming. So we're just going to send incoming back. And hope you... Oh, wait, you always said you're doing good. Hey, rain, eviction notice. Yep. I think we really are becoming creatures of habit. <laughs> you okay. Up and down. <laughs> okay, nail ring. No, breakfast was out of range for that, sadly. All of you attack towards this place. Breakfast. Go disrupt those for a moment. Breakfast? What's a breakfast? <laughs> they actually tried to shoot up at him. Okay. Nail brain. Oh, never mind. Oh no! Oh no, my brain! What? Is it the bird? Is it the plane? No, no it's below the breakfast. <laughs> okay. 
Okay, that might have been a bit of a bad idea, but oh well. Okay, I'm not really sure if this counts as hit and run if you just, well, stomp in somewhere from your freaking stratosphere. <laughs> Oop, Neil Brain, primary target right there. Okay, that and that should deal with it, yep. Okay, Spookums. Deal with that. And just everyone attack and just get rid of them. It actually takes him longer to come down now, but it's, it's worth it. <laughs> That's what you want. Okay. Got it, boy. Who do you think you is stealing what we done rightfully stole? Boys, get in there and take that note back. No, oh, go there. I'll get there. <laughs> okay, just gotta hold it for a while. <clears throat> Rick Best, welcome committee. <laughs> okay, I probably should give. <laughs> I probably should look up uh, a video of all the, the voice lines from this game at some points, or at the very least, all the orcs one, uh, orc ones. <laughs> Okay. Intercept trajectory, you could call that. Okay, okay, so the, the distance does have an effect on how long it takes, which makes sense. Breakfast, deal with that one. He has become a force on his own. <laughs> Nail brain, thank you. Nail brain, targets. Breakfast, shove a can <laughs> shove a grenade up in Can's ass. Okay. Give the captain a hand. Oh okay. no, I just had an insane idea. We still ain't got to power no back. Boys, leg it back to Daisy, sharpish! Kick these thieving magpies off the last note! I get your plan. No. Uh, imagine breakfast delivering pizzas for that. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he'd lose the box every single freaking time. From the explosion or himself eating them? Uh, both. That's <laughs> just <laughs> freaking hilarious about him just shooting up into the stratosphere like that. That summoned the reinforcements. Ok, 
Sí. A lot, yeah. <laughs> so let's take this <laughs> and get it some troops. Or jumps over, slumps over dead. Okay, nail brain, capture that. <coughs> Merry coffee today. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Let's hope you're not getting sick. Hmm. Okay. Well, I think we can guess what we're going for. <laughs> oh dear. Okay, we need power for basically everything else except for Ord Boys. And that should, yeah, that should leave us with only five population left. Okay, get to your shooters. <laughs> okay, this is a this is a decent raiding band. Okay, here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Yep. Breakfast disrupts. Yep. I was about to ask, taking your time there, <laughs> enjoying the view. Okay. Everyone in defensive positions. And one of them fell asleep at the wheel. Okay. You there, you there. You would think that we were so excited, so excited to fall asleep. But I'd be fighting. Boss, they got another power node. Oh, well, that's just greedy, that is. Oh, I'm sending in the big dagger to take it back. <laughs> just over there. Find Ah, there they come. <laughs> Okay, yeah, with a cover of a tank, I think this should be a done deal. Well, do I have upgrades for the loot the tanks? Nope. But we can get an upgrade get for them. them from this level. Oh yeah, then definitely we should get that. But that's before we have a point. How did you... What is hitting your <laughs> rear there? Yeah, okay. Looks like they're only going to come from that direction for the moment. Okay, back into position. Oop, never mind. Okay, you move into that spot. And yeah, telling them to move and aim in a certain uh, point in a certain direction is a better idea than just clicking for, for where they should go. Yeah, they, they really are just coming from that direction. Alright, nail brain, pull back. Actually, put some holes in that can. Spook him. Clean up after. <laughs> I think. Okay. 
<laughs> that was almost hilariously one-sided. <laughs> hmm. And we get more resources. Should we get some reinforcement? Uh, let's see. Yep, there you are still there. Did we lose some? Be let's see. We got. Th I'm pretty sure it was. This was, yeah, this was going to hit 75. Uh, wait, no. That. Oh right, it's. I miscalculated. It seems. Okay. Uh, wait, Some burner wait, boys then. Maybe we can still recruit one more. Apparently, there's something that only costs five. Uh, that's a weird boy. Might as well <laughs> to finish down yeah, this war well. band. <laughs> okay, let's put that back on blood flag. Oh, we got a lot of work. <laughs> Okay, we've got 999 walk, which is, yeah, it was explained to us that we get that from uh, killing and being killed, I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure. Oh, that makes sense. And well, we killed plenty. That's more things for technically, I see. Oh, so I'm pretty sure when it says rocks here, it doesn't mean the birds. Yeah, I think that's a good word for a well, regular rock. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, that really does just pull enemies in close. Okay, tank division. I'm going to quickly rename you as number five. You love me six. And yeah, there doesn't seem to be space. <laughs> there doesn't seem to be space for the weird boy on this. Good uh, fight. let's. See. Uh, where is the weird boy? Oh <laughs> uh, well. Just as likely that they exploded themselves somewhere. Uh, no, they're still alive for... Wait, don't you have so you can grab them from uh, the side of the team? Yeah, there's, not, there's no space. You want something stopped around here? You gotta stop it yourself. Don't me, Daisy. Welp. <laughs> okay, it's not taking much if any damage though. Okay. I think we might actually have too many units here. <laughs> we need to bait it into the... <laughs> Big uh, explosive barrels. Yeah. <laughs> okay. You. Our tanks have gotten pretty banged up already on their own. What the heck? Why? Oh, you idiots are still here. Get up there. Okay. Uh, we might be able to just tip it down. Uh, other than that, maybe try and reposition some people so that it will actually run into the barrels if it decides to... <laughs> if it does decide to uh, charge. Okay. Is it going to charge or not? Uh, no, it's going to shoot. Yeah, move okay, so we can hopefully make it move into the uh, fuels. Oh. Okay, that, yep, that's the end of those. 
The awful one final drive, it seems. Okay, is it specifically targeting the tanks? It, it looks like it is, it is specifically targeting the tanks. And yeah, there's the weird boy. Okay, so even though it looks like these have already exploded, they still work. <laughs> and, yeah. It, it does specifically target your vehicles to take them out before it starts using the death roller. I guess they, uh... Yeah. Uh, who's the target? Oh, Blood Flag's the target. Okay, it's going to... Miss. Okay. Crush him under the death roller! Yep, break fists. That's completely not where he was going, or where he was. Okay, we are losing units, but that's because the ads are pestering our sides. Okay, he's go he should hit those there. Yeah. Okay, still got him. But yeah, that's the best way to get rid of this thing. It just takes out a quarter of its health. Okay, get in position. It, it literally just hops up. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> oh, my only regret is exploding! Yeah! Oh, you poor, poor thing. Look what we've got and done to you. Come in, come in. Can we escape, huh? Okay, Nail Brain. But it's your charge. Uh, keep it fueled and armed, and take it out for rocks. Hooray! Oh, take good care of it, you see? Come here and let old Uncle Nailbrain fix you up. <laughs> it's feeling it like it's a fucking puppy. Please stop! <laughs> 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 And now we have access to our super heavy vehicle, the Battle Wagon. Uh, heavy assault transport with anti-vehicle weaponry, anti-infantry shooters are activated when any two squads garrison the, yo, garrison the Battle Wagon. Okay, so we can just put two, uh, <laughs> two boys in a squad, the, the, two squads of boys in there. And they'll bring out a level. And oh, forgot the chunk. Uh, forget. Uh, forgot to check the chunks. Yeah, if it was some <laughs> kind of war gear. And it should still be uh, available in this here in a sec. Now let's see. Is that big old hammer? This hammer is more good than that other less good hammer, of course. But we're going for this, of course. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Grim Gibbons, plus 15 melee skill and 8 melee resistance. Okay. Hey, his guts is on the floor. Grab him and put him to good use. <laughs> really? Oh, so uh. those are... Oh. Ew. Yeah. Hmm. Super tough beam. Make a friendly unit invulnerable. That actually sounds like it would match up perfectly with Spookum's targeting dummy. 
which has a which has a unit taunt enemies. So let's actually go for that. A bit of an experimental combo. Let's see. Oh, Bird that's fist. a nice cutlass. <laughs> uh, yeah, of course it's orky, so it has to have the checkered pattern on it. <laughs> hmm. No real usable or new weapons for anyone. Armor, maybe? Let's see, 82. Yeah, plus 100 health and plus movement speeds. Uh, let's see. Breakfast. Can't use that. Okay. Too well armored. Uh, oh, no. It's left. <laughs> they aren't leveled enough for to use it. Okay. Uh, but I think if we sacrifice a few things... It might be enough to push it over. No, we're like one item. Actually, there we go. Level 10. Yeah, let's give this to breakfast. It's not that much of an upgrade. Um, actually, I th having him be suppression proof might be better since he's constantly going to move into combat and again he can just jump into into melee. Yeah, he can just jump into them and having him be able to move faster does make him more dangerous and having a bit more health as well helps. Yeah. Okay, Spookums, you get that since you're not, well, you're not supposed to be in melee, but you have a flamer, so you're going to get into melee. And yeah, targeting dummy and breakfast. Whenever jumping, okay, whenever finishing a jump, breakfast will be targeted by nearby enemies. Hmm. Could we combo that with targeting? Actually, targeting dummy would not work too well since he's already drawing attention. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, let's go for this one. Menacing to demoralize and just <clears throat> have a suppression aura. Okay, then only nail brains needs to get a bit more leveled. Actually, is that better than your armor? Uh, damage resistance overall. But you are more at this back line. There. Holy, that, that, that's a new uh, look. Yeah, yeah he, he's, he's keeping that just because that actually gives him a stick. <laughs> okay, I, I do like that they did put in the time to put in at least a few different looks for the armor and such. Okay. Oh, oh, and now we're going to loot the Eldar. Smash through it. Vehicles and monstrous creatures can smash through many walls and cover, creating flanking opportunities and shortcuts. You! You dare violate this tomb! You pathetic, soulless savages! Very well. If you are so eager to hear our cries, I shall shred your mind with the wail of the Banshee! Butcher them! Do not let them near the gates or the assembly! Mr. Nailbrain, oh dear. it looks to me like these Eldars want to run off with all these nice shiny bits and gobbins. Well, Captain, that's just rude, that is. Head off the Wheeze all the way down here to steal them. What should we do, sir? Well, Mr. Nailbrain, I reckons we should kill them. Horribly, of course. Freebooters! <laughs> I seriously sort of feel like Nail Brain and uh, Bloodfuck is the Oak version of us. Basically, I'd say. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Keep moving. Keep looting. It's just minor resistance at the moment, which well makes sense. This place has been shot to bits already, so there's not many of them. <laughs> okay. There. Okay. Move forwards. 
Protect the workway gates! They lend the power to hasten our escape! Losing one will slow the assembly's departure into the webway! Cabin! The old horses using those funny-looking teleporter tanks to escape! What? Well, I guess we should smash them then. Who is going to anyways? <laughs> of course. Okay, close the distance. And yeah, <laughs> just pulls them all in. Okay, yeah. Would be best to combo that with uh, the stomp right after. Break fists. Incoming. It, it would never not be funny that we just he just gets up so high that we don't even hear him anymore. <sighs> okay, I missed half of what that said there, but I want to know what he said there. I, 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 I was on this fight, I forgot to read. Yeah, it, it was that wasn't a, that wasn't a red a subtitled line. It was just some banter between them. Oh. Just try and take it from us. Try. Someone's trying very hard to sound hard. That was a line reacting uh, to them blowing up the building or something, or taunting about them blowing up the building. And <laughs> There's also something funny about all of them just aiming up. Oop. Ardle's suit hammer? <laughs> it's blue! This place is lucky! <laughs> okay. Now, what sort of... Actually, I think we want to wait until we're over here with calling in reinforcements. I just say we could get some uh, knobs and shoot us. Uh, loot us, I mean. <laughs> okay, now overlook this. We have a time limit to go with. Hmm. Yeah, definitely but get the knobs and loot us then. But destroying the webway gates... Blaze it. Rod just constantly trying to suck up. Oh dear. This here is mine. Mine. Okay. Let's see. Yeah, we have enough space for one tank. <laughs> I wonder if it actually. I don't think that he actually gets damaged while he's up in the air like that. Yep. There we go. Had my yeah, hands. Had my hand misaligned. Okay. <laughs> okay. There That's they are. Job. <laughs> yeah, all of them will complain about that. Okay. <laughs> I was, might as well get that tank. Or actually, mm, yes, yes we, if we, we get Daisy. Incoming from behind. <laughs> Grab tank. Yeah, I see. Breakfasts. 
Go shove a fist up their tailpipe. And a one, and a two, and a... And he's late. Oh, there he is. <laughs> it's like trying to shoot down a meteorite. <laughs> oh, mega boom shot? Okay. <laughs> I did right over there then. <laughs> you might want to get out of the way, breakfast. Okay, that didn't look as impressive. Uh, kill that thing, please. Thank you. Warp head banner. Okay. No. How does it actually look? Okay, it doesn't look like he's actually he actually does it. Nibble and scavenge at our bodies, mindless vermin. The Inquisition's ships come for all in this sector. It matters not whether you die by our hand or theirs. Blah, blah, blah. Hurry up and die today. Mr. Nailbrain, have you ever noticed that whenever you kill one of these guys, they say something like that? Now, look sharp, boys. Get all this loot for it all gets covered in Eldar's blood. Stains it does. It's a blood plaque tapping on the fourth wall a bit there. A booby trap. Okay, can we detonate it? Okay, let's see. Ardol suit hour. <clears throat> Ardholz. Now there was a knob who could get at just what you, you know, where you wanted to go. Didn't matter how many rocks, boys, yumis, and gits uh, was in the way, Ardholz would find a uh, find just a path. Okay. And wait, his weapon looks lo good. You might find a thing you may find a new breakfast weapon. <laughs> yeah. And yeah, upgrade. Good. Yep. <laughs> Upgrade for the weird boy and shoot your big shoot up. It's like a big shoot up, but shoot here. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> pardon? Hey. Yeah. Pardon. Let's see. Yeah. A power claw or knob leaders. Let's see. This knob leader is a particularly ferocious specimen that is capable of keeping other knobs in line. Increases the durability of the squad and increases melee damage. Yeah, I, I don't think we're going to need any of that anymore. Now, breakfast. Get yourselves a new uh, door knocker. <laughs> <laughs> okay, expand that. Now, let's see. You have a good leveled weapon. You have a decent leveled weapon. You the same. Okay. Hmm. Shoot here, big shooter. Give you melee? Okay, that would be an idea. He does have the shields, the discharge, and he would yeah, normally be, or if you go down the offense line, he'd have the Mega Rumbler, which I presume would also be set off at his position. Hmm. Let's see. How is that compared to what you have now? Hmm. I think I actually. What does this give him? Okay, yeah, that's a better. <laughs> that's a better rocket launcher. <laughs> Who is a clumper? <laughs> okay, chance to disable or stun infantry on hits. Okay. Oh, it'll drop the uh, cruiser right enough. The problems when the boys come out of the cruise at the sea who dropped them. <laughs> <laughs> uh, of course. Yeah, okay. Well, I think we're all set for what's likely the finale then. This armor is a sacred relic of the Adeptus Astartes. We shall deliver it to our 
Chapter Master. Lord Kyrus now serves the Dark Powers. You now serve the Dark Powers. This corpse god's base we stand in is not a sanctified shrine of your chapter. It is a fort to be plundered. And this land raider we have unearthed is not a relic. It is a spoil of war to be defiled and bent to our will. My lords, come in. Do you read? What is it, Well, Why do you interrupt? Beg your forgiveness, my lord, but we found another one. Mate, you. Makes me right proud to see these humans backstabbing each other. Still, let's show them how it's really done. They found two land raiders? <laughs> okay. <laughs> hmm. Okay, so this doesn't sound like the final level then, but we're getting close there anyways. Oh yeah. Hmm. Was I wrong then that it would like that this would end <laughs> that we'd be able to finish in this stream? We'll see. Uh, we might be able to finish here. this stream. Let's hurry. Get this thing moving. They're gonna slaughter us. Slit them open, boys. <laughs> Right, I was saying, I think we might be able to finish it this uh, stream, however, we may not be able to start on the next one. Yeah, depending. <clears throat> yeah, yeah th this is very much not going to be the last level like I thought. Hmm. Yep, <laughs> don't scratch the paint. <laughs> okay, fuck the land radar, I guess. <laughs> What's the plan? Okay. I did, I, I got a surprise. And they didn't loot it. <laughs> yeah, I guess it doesn't compare to Daisy, though. This here is mine. Mine. Okay. And, well, a lady like Daisy does deserve an escort. If, if, if we had the power for it, that it was. Okay. Well, time to screw with the Eldar. Yeah, not, the, not the Eldar. Time to screw with Chaos. Where are you going? Uh, and a long yeah. way. Hmm. Is that ability just glitched or something? No, there it... Okay, why did it not have to do that before? Oh. Found yourself some friends? Oh, don't I? Just... Yeah, do I'm all crumpin'. <laughs> Okay. Yep. Nail brain, get out of there. Yep. Tank. Okay. There we go. Okay. Oh, <laughs> his demons followed him. Okay. <laughs> Who needs a flamethrower when you have a big freaking battle wagon? Actually, what we should do is get two squads of boys and put those in Daisy to put her anti-infantry anti guns to work. You lot, there. 
Tank first. Okay, now wreck that place. Okay, then we'll just go back around like this, capture those points. Okay. Yeah, certain, uh, certainly looks like it, and the freaking noise, the noise marines are dropping the base again. Okay, we'll drop something on you instead. The base! Yeah, the base of Brickfish's boots. Okay, they're in. Okay. Now get the reholding some cultists. Okay. Now, this way. And yeah, I, I guess I severely oh. underestimated how long the game would take them because I. The, from the way Blood Flag was talking last time, I had the idea that we were tracking Cyrus down directly to here. But no, I guess we still have to look around the place. This would make sense. And I say something can capture from Moon. Yep, yeah, yeah. Take care of that one. Probably <laughs> even scratch the paint. Okay, Nail Brain, capture that, please. Okay. Everyone else, move to the next point. Though it should be... Uh, not you, I said everyone else. Okay. Okay. Best to push towards here. And, okay, there's, the other two are just the other end of the map. This here is mine. Mine. Okay. Now, where is that tank escort? Uh, riches, boss. Still not enough power. <laughs> Come on. And then again, these have both been requisition points. And not both. Hmm. Oh, well. <laughs> we have a big freaking tank, so we... <laughs> Really need others. Okay, there is a power node over there, though. Nice. Okay, I was expecting there to be enemies in there. Yep. Never mind. Okay. Ooh. 58 Cadian Fire Drakes. Cadian Soldiers, okay. Spookums. Spookums going the long way around. Breakfast doesn't have to travel that long, in though. Okay. Now Lehman Russ. It's going to be Lehman Scraps soon. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> More of the chickens. Okay. Hmm. Breakfast. Yep. Never mind. Okay. Did they get teleported by Nail Brains' thing? <laughs> okay. And don't really think that we need that uh, power node. Hmm? Where are oh, there you are. Incoming. <laughs> 
and just plain gone. I flew up so high that I landed on the wall. You're here, now you're over there. There, up its tailpipe, and Daisy finishes off. Okay. Uh, yeah, we could we could just punch straight for the walls here. If we can get so able to recruit some more units, or at least more tanks. Yep, knock knock. It doesn't see what kind of upgrades we can do to the looted tanks now. <laughs> okay. Spookums, send your typical eviction notice. Oop, hello. And that's... Uh, just another Lehman Ross. Bye-bye. Okay. Oh, actually, someone capture that. And then we just set these to auto produce, and well, the tanks will come for us automatically then. <laughs> okay. Rest of you, get moving. Daisy, turn your ass around. Okay. Yeah, and there come the tanks. <laughs> okay, that's going to be fun seeing what they get across, what they run across as they head over. Yep, it's a razor back. There we go. Ooh. Hello. Hmm. I expected them to at least run into something. Breakfast. Take care of that tank. Oh. At least you can disable the uh, anti-vehicle. And yeah, this tactical blood ravens. Oh. Lee. <laughs> okay, he just glory killed something. <laughs> Alright, where is... Where? Okay, one of the tanks got destroyed, so... Repair that quick. They got the drop on us there, and looks like that tank did run into something and got blown up by it. Okay, breakfast, take care of these before they become a problem, because I recognize a rocket launcher when I see one. <laughs> oh, that's what's, what's, that's what's going on. Yep. <laughs> They hold up in there with the rocket launcher. Okay. Well, then we just need to eliminate it, don't we? And Nail Brain just got run over. <laughs> okay, Daisy took care of that problem on her own. <laughs> Okay, I, I wanted you to clear the building. Let's clear the building off the map. <laughs> you threw a, grenade, a lot of grenades and what did you expect to happen? You will ruin building. Good point. Okay. At least there's at least there's a backup tanks coming. Okay. Yeah, no need for that point. Daisy is almost done. Oh, she is done. 
Okay. Last one. Okay, they are just lazily uh, potting along. Nail brain, focus that one. Oops. That didn't last long. <laughs> yes. Now I can feel it. Uh oh. The frenzy. The blood loss that Lord Kyra spoke of. Well, that's a land raider, apparently. And of course, leave it to <laughs> leave it to where Cornite recruits to just start murdering their own units. Oh, okay. Dear. All of you idiots to the middle. Uh, do we get a tank reinforcement? Or actually, yeah, we don't have I enough think power. Need some, in me, the, what else can we make? Uh, let's see. We should well, we probably make some looters. Okay, lasers. Okay. Let's not have them let not let's not have them going first. Yep, never mind. Might as well try and get this out. Oh, come on, cowards. So much for them, and they're just stuck in the door here. Oh dear. These two going at it like oversized battle bots. We took on a fucking land raider. <laughs> okay. Burn a stick bomb. Okay, that's going to be better than just stunning or smoking. <laughs> and dead art super flash armor. <laughs> okay, ninety eight. <laughs> okay, yeah, that that's going on. That's going on breakfast. Once a squig had stepped on me in this and it didn't even notice. I'm calling bullshit on that. <laughs> okay. And Gargant Hunter. Okay, rocket launcher. Fires more rockets. Increased area of effect. And actually more accurate. <laughs> Somehow. The only thing this massive rocket launcher is missing is Grotz to pilot the rockets. <laughs> uh, uh, okay, there is the last mission. Okay, nail brain. Hmm. Let's let's put this one in so Daisy can get a resurrection. <laughs> okay, Spookums. Uh, yeah, let's trade those ones out. Hmm. Let's see. Ta -ta -ta. Where was that? There, there it is. Throws extra bombs when using abilities and will occasionally toss excess bombs he brought along with him. Okay, so that was uh, this bag of bombs. Any stick, stun, or burn up uh, bombs? Okay, yeah. So now, now he is fully equipped with this. I kind of missed the burn up bits on there last time. So yeah, now, now he is fully equipped for just blowing shit up. <laughs> Yes. 
Yeah, let's actually first to compare that against your armor. Hmm. Let's give it the break fist. There we go. Just all the freaking extra missiles. Oh, okay. Yeah. Let's see. One final check of stuff. 82. Spookums. Yeah, let's give that to you so you're a little bit faster. And yeah, just a little bit more there. Okay. Well, time to end this story then. on deck! It's time to finish this spiky song! Great. A core night nihilist. Okay. Oh dear. The last stand. This battle will decide the fate of the entire sector. Hold nothing back. If Kairos survives this day, he will be victorious. In dedication to Korn, many of the Chaos Warriors and Demons pledge allegiance to Korn. Expect melee and heavy vehicle deployments. Okay, one last check. Melee, anti-vehicle, just fuck everything in the general's direction. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> our own personal airstrike. Oh dear. Okay, this is the final conflict. You will not be returning to the star map points deployed. Be certain you are ready. Yes. Gabriel Angelos. Gabriel Angelos has led the Blood Ravens through countless campaigns, including the liberation of Tartarus, meeting Elder, Orcs, and Space Marines in battle. Though he brought fixed vi their victory for the Imperium of Man, he inadvertently released a demon from its prison in the Maledictum, a mistake which Angelos has long sought to correct. The machinations of the mysterious demon and Gabriel's efforts to combat them have rippled throughout the subsector, ultimately threatening every race and every being there, prompting all to act for their own reasons. Now the chain of events Wait. draws near its end. Wait. So is it this demon we released in the last game? I mean, in, in, in the first uh, Dawn of War? Uh, maybe, maybe not. But I'm guessing that is what Kairos means with uh, Korn's messenger. Yeah, because... for the demon we released was also a Kornite demon. Yeah, and well, we, we put <laughs> we put uh, Ulker in a power nap, so it definitely wasn't him. Plus, he's a Nurgle demon. So yeah, comes back around, huh? Yeah.
stranger to the deaths of planets. Cyrene was my home. Yet when the need was made evident, I did not hesitate to contact the Inquisition. By my hand, Cyrene burned. Cyrene's secrets now live solely with me, and so shall they die with me. Whether I'm victorious or slain, my sins will know retribution. Such is the final testimony of Gabriel Angelos, captain of the Blood Ravens, Third Company. Savior of Tartarus, bane of the Black Legion, servant of the Emperor. And speaking of uh, coming back around... <laughs> Yeah, this is where the prologue happens, and that demon that we've seen every time in the intro, that was Kairos as a demon prince. Oh dear. <laughs> okay. One of you grab that, the rest of you... There, uh, there. Come on. Wait. There. On. You want me? Yeah. Mm. Not to close, they do. Mm. And why they were just stopping there? Yeah, they were. Similarly, we got a bit stuck no. there. Like, uh, they, they all tried to squeeze through the same door at the same time. Yeah. <laughs> Get over there and get on their foot. Uh, a sector wide civil war, and here we are just looting the place, not giving a fuck about anything else. <laughs> We'll want to capture that and call in Daisy. Okay, breakfast. There we go. Get your shield up. Okay, and there we go. <laughs> okay, that's just a freaking lot of them, huh? Yeah. Oh, I hope we can get to game three out, Daisy. <laughs> okay. Break fists. Go be a nuisance over there. I kind of, I find it kind of funny that I was kind of bath mouthing breakfast at the beginning of the game, seeing he saying that he got the least person, <laughs> the least uh, characterization and such, and he's now become maybe my my favorite character after Blood Flag. <laughs> okay, you break off and just capture that. Okay. Yeah, we could have just gotten that if we went the other way. Okay, build ambush. Not that I don't think he can take it. Not that I think he can't take them. <laughs> it's taking off like fucking Superman. Oh, okay, we can... Alright, he's... Those things count as vehicles, so he can't stab them. Well, he could stab them, but all he'd be doing was blunting his blade. Now that I expect that uh, orc knives aren't all that sharp to begin with, like their owners. Well, they're probably all sharp, but they're all more like a heavy cleaver. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Well, I guess you could say this. They, they all like an axe in sword yeah. form. 
Let's see. Yeah. These many decades have been an honor, Gabriel. Commend my service to the Emperor. Emperor, keep you, librarian. I go now to redeem our chapter. Such are the ways of demons to lie and mislead us. Destroying it is the only way to avoid its influences. Okay. Looks like we're going to need to hurry before we get <laughs> before Gabriel kills that yeah, kill steals us. <laughs> That's our guy to kill, not yours. <laughs> Spookums is playing dead again. Okay. Go disrupt that line. Rinkies delivers over. No we over. Actually, Nail Brain, you focus that one down. You go there. What is that you didn't finish the job with the dreadnoughts? <laughs> you grab that quickly. Okay. something we want. Yep, there's a headquarters here. Get into melee, you idiots. Okay, if you're not going to go into melee, get them into melee. <laughs> okay. There was a dreadnought there. Where did it go? Ah, there you are. There we go. As cute as it be as it is to have a, a quick draw with a Dreadnought and an Org Mech, we have other things to do. Yeah, I see resources. Okay, okay grab those. Yep. Blood flag, you grab that. Let's see. Another split path that leads to the same place? Okay. Okay. Daisy. This here is mine. Mine. <laughs> okay. Then we get her support crew. Oh, uh, never mind. Uh, breakfast. Where are you? There you are. Go nap that quick. Okay, do we not have sight? Okay, the game's not going to let us skip right over there. So I'm guessing there is a trigger and we need to hit. Okay. Anyways, you idiots get in there. Native Brain, you actually go in there as well. See if that works as well. Plus, he is not the most useful at the moment. So until we run into other vehicles, he's going to just hitch a ride. Do we get any benefit for them to be inside it? When there's two squads in there, uh, Daisy can actually use her anti-inventory uh, weapons. So yes, there is a there is a yeah, a positive to putting them in there. Okay, blood flag. Where the heck are you? Yeah, you're over there. See. Which makes sense since there's two turrets on this thing. <laughs> Ooh, blood flag is getting into problems. Again, he's an orc. <laughs> They're not in problems. 
for causing them. They're not being orcs. <laughs> Nail brain, get out, deal with those. Breakfast, land a hand with that. Okay, keep pushing forwards. There. <laughs> and the captain is managing to push through to the entire other flank himself. <laughs> okay. There we go. Someone grab this. Let's grab that way we can start the raid. Who is to uh, grab some good uh, reinforcements? Okay, we need more population first, though. Okay. Yeah, I hope we get to go near one of those soon. Let's see, there's one over Wait. there, it looks. Yeah, I was just going down. Okay, he definitely does not like that, huh? <laughs> Let's do it some more. Okay, that's... Uh... Hmm? All the blood ravens! If you don't keep moving, <laughs> of course, you idiots grab that. Get back in. Okay, we can reinforce at the uh, next headquarters over here. Okay, and yeah, it looks like Gabriel might have bitten off a bit more than he could chew this time. Oh dear. You want speed? Okay, yeah. Uh, that symbol is them preparing to teleport over and it shows where they will appear. Okay. Yep. Male brain. Spookums. Capture that quick. The other squads of gunners. Let's be gonna need some mobs as well. <laughs> Get in there. It's let's see, what can we afford? Some tanks, of course. Ow. <laughs> okay. Okay, get moving. Oh, phasing two of them, huh? Well, not anymore. Now it's a bit of a more of a pair. Actually, now it's less of a fair fight because I'm pretty sure he looked like could take two of these anyways. <laughs> I 
Okay. Yep. Yeah, everyone, go get Nail Brains' ass out of the fire. So where? Why did you turn up your shields? Actually, just go run up and give him a hug. <laughs> As one of them gets annihilated. There it is. Okay, I'm pretty sure it said 99 earlier, but it didn't seem to do much. <laughs> Okay. Oop. Now brain, get the box. And now that spookums. Okay. Break first, grab that. And meantime, everyone else break that. There you go, patch up some holes. What 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 are you in the cats? Let's see. Fists, disrupt them before they put a hole in the armor. Okay. Everyone move. Ooh, hello. Yes. <laughs> yeah, Brickfist doesn't give a crap about suppression since you can't dis <laughs> you can't suppress the airways. Yeah, we can figure that out at the next headquarters there over there. Yeah, no, come on. <laughs> I almost saw the game crash there, but no, it just got deselected for... Again, I just don't get why that just randomly happens. It has just waiting really has notice, but... But it does, it does give us a bit of a heart attack on those. And how much do you have, Ray? Yeah. I don't think we need to be done with this campaign. Uh, yeah, uh, plenty of yeah. time still. But do is it time to start the mix? It's how they know. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, but still good that we went for a half hour extra. Yeah. Nail brain, capture that. Break fists. Okay. That is plenty of resources for one last tank. <laughs> Okay, everyone get there. There's a requisition point there, but I don't think we'll need it. We do have a little bit more space. More units, uh, good population cap. Oop. Run tank is almost gone. Male brain, can you fix up that? Okay. Plug that again later. That's going to miss, but I will. Uh, 
Okay. Oh, bit some stragglers. Oh, get it. I get it anyway. Don't yeah, be surprised if my headquarters will almost be done charging by now. <laughs> <laughs> Another population thing? Yep. Um. Da -da -da -da, better be more resources for us to hurt yet. Okay, Spookums, clear out the buildings. Armor, clear well, the buildings. <laughs> okay. Someone's almost down. Spookums, what are you doing there? Okay, one of them was going down the slow way, it seems. Okay, get rid of that thing. That's not the tank. That. Okay, yeah, let's get let's get moving before those rocks land. Too late. Oh, I think we're going to lose that tank. Yep. Oh well. Wait. Can we recruit another decent? Uh we can only have one of them. Because it's frayed out now. Maximum of one. Alright. But well, we can park that right there. Okay. Time to finish this. Blood flag wants his new hats. There's a there's a marker there before the boss fight. Uh, cross. Uh, one more, one more headquarters. All right. Okay, nail brain. Go capture that. Actually, Daisy, go park next to that and get some repairs. We missed, missed another resource actually on the map. Yeah, this one here, but we don't really need more requisition, I believe. We could have used it to get something more now, but oh well. Okay. Nail brain. Actually, you get. To, oh. Okay, someone had the Taco Bell special. You want speed? Yeah, right now mean, everyone got teleported really here. Grab the damn thing. And move all of us here. Okay, breakfast. You know, move over quickly to get that. Okay, mail brain, repairs. There are special abilities now, I see. The yeah, they have, the, they have the big shot now. Is that enough to take these things out? No. <laughs> it is enough to knock them away. Wait. Get back in there, you idiots. Okay, so those will come up and make him temporarily invulnerable unless we kill him, or unless we destroy them. Do, 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 do we get some, do we get some rewards? Yep. 
So no matter what, we can keep fighting here. No. Move up, you idiots! You're still repairing, okay. Okay, everyone change focus. And yeah, now it basically becomes a slug fest. Ooh. Oh dear, there's more of this issue on the ground. Oh no, that. Okay, at least those flashes aren't happening too quickly. Okay. Yep. yep, could have seen that coming. Doesn't do too much damage, though. And nailed rain. All right, nail brain. <laughs> nail brains is perk. Give them a second chance. <laughs> okay. Let's see. He's been throwing rocks all day now. Where are those going to land? Uh, there, apparently. Okay. They... If those were, mar if that was marks where it would land, I didn't see it. Okay. Change focus. How do we get resources back? Hmm. Uh, we are, but <laughs> the tanks are spawning all the way over here. Okay, let's turn that off and turn it on here. <laughs> okay, it's just, just taking the long way to get here. <laughs> oh dear. Uh, ambush. Yep, ambush and ambushers. There goes Daisy. Oh no. Yep. No, there is Daisy. No brain repairs. Get in there. Actually, you oh, all spread what? out some. Um, I think we broke the cat. Yeah. Maybe for a bit there, but it reset itself. Okay. Yeah, it's going to explode in the air. Uh, oh, rather, I think we lost a unit. Did? Okay, I thought he'd move up closer, but... <laughs> Okay, fancy fireworks all the same. Okay, Daisy survived that. Hmm. Okay, this shouldn't take too much longer. Everyone, focus these down. Okay, if there if there is one way to do a blinding flash that isn't actually well too blinding, I'd say this would be the way. Yeah. <laughs> Move away, that's something dropping down. And of course, again, despite all the works as tech, we just hit him with a big rock to finish him off. <laughs> uh. 
Peter Maledictus. Wait, yeah, what was his name, Maledictus? Yeah, the Maledictum was the, the rock that he was stuck in, I believe. Or Maledict... something like that. <clears throat> oh dear. <laughs> Nice hat. <laughs> you sneaky little Humi. You thought you could wiggle out of our deal and just kill old Bloodflag. But no. Instead, sneak it. No, wait! Oh. And if you's not good for a fight, ah. then what good are you? Ah. Ha. Well. I guess this all wasn't a total loss. <laughs> Time to teleport on this thing. <laughs> they actually turned the fucking thing into a new ship. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I, I, I must have completely forgotten that bit, but I, I knew he was going to mug her for her hat, but I didn't know they'd actually turned the judgment of Clarion into a new cruiser. <laughs> Would make sense. And yeah, would you think it's Lim? If it put her like, well, she's not worth a fight, so just grab her hat. And there's actually a name for that hat. No. Uh, Dutch tall hat. <laughs> okay, all the more fitting that blood flag runs off with it then. But <laughs> 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 uh, yeah, that's uh, the story of Dawn of War 2 Retribution done from the orcs perspective because i'm pretty sure none of the space marines will ever want to talk about this ever again <laughs> and yeah nice little yeah on the upper half we get the storyboarding and on the lower half we have the actual cinematics <laughs> but yeah that <laughs> that was just a ton of fun Yep. And now we just get to see these play Rock'em Sock'em robots. Go <laughs> Rock'em Slice him. <laughs> uh. Yes, it is. Just knowing there will be different endings and all that, that makes me willing to do the other stories. <laughs> yeah, like... <clears throat> nope, hello. <laughs> I'll take that. And your soul. <laughs> Okay, but yeah, once we're done with the <clears throat> Space Marine, uh, yeah, Space Marine uh, campaign, or just playing through it with the Space Marines, because it is basically the same campaign, just with different texts and such, and some some slight changes in the uh, missions and such. Like we're not, if we play as the Elder, we're not going to raid their own freaking destroyed craft world. It's probably going to be a defense thing. <clears throat> But yeah, once we've done our run as the Space Marines, we'll move this game to the side quests to uh, yeah, play through the other factions. Yeah, hmm. it just makes sense to do. Okay, and that's how they made, or they, that's how they came up with the head for the Elder. <laughs> All right, the, the Elder leader, <laughs> the first boss we killed. But yeah, there's just so much that goes into the work with these games. All these animations and the glory kills. <laughs> oh, uh. And yeah, as you can guess, the uh, Imperial Guards will have one of these jackasses along. You could have dressed like one almost. <laughs> okay. The biggest question now, though, is uh, should we get you a new hat for the other campaigns or keep this one? 
it would be fitting uh, to have different hats for different campaigns. The voice actors, uh, let's see. Hmm. Inquisitor Adrasiar, Kirsten Potter, okay. Uh, Otto Kalis, Abaddon. Shut that thing up. Uh, let's see. Kyris, Peter Giles. And also the Space Hulk AI voice, okay. Uh, I hope I hope Blood Flag hasn't passed by on this yet, so let's keep an eye out for them. Steve Blum for the Orc boys, of course. And, okay, we did miss him. <laughs> All right. Let's do a quick little IMDb uh, look up then. Uh, let's see. IMDb Dawn of War 2 Retribution There <clears throat> Yeah, I gotta say I also like it that they just show art, but also the, the glory some of the glory kill animations during this It's a lot better than just a blank, you know, a blank background Like yeah. some games just do these days oh, The Inquisitor versus Tyranids <laughs> okay, I know I think we know <laughs> I think we know who brings the fireworks. <clears throat> but yeah, I think the only thing I would actually complain about with this game might be the length of each individual playthrough. Oh. Oh, more storyboarding and early animations on this, huh? <laughs> but, yeah, they, they did put in six factions, so it does make sense that uh, each playthrough is a lot shorter. <laughs> okay, so a very crude animation there. <laughs> okay. But yeah, just different stages of the work, huh? It's always interesting to see, or get at least a peek oh, into. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, and speaking of a boring blank background, or is it going to do more? <laughs> okay, now let's have a bit of a look here. Let's see, top cast. Let's see. Jonah, Banshee, I'm just finding page. Let's see. Blood. Let's see. Patrick Zeist? Or Zeitz? Uh, S E I T Z. Also the voice actor for Avadon, apparently. Okay. What else have you been up to? That's a video up here. Still alive from the looks of it. Okay. Uh, really? <laughs> the second one on here is uh, Detective Pikachu returns as various voices or additional voices. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's see. Bleach. I wouldn't rec recognize any names there anyways. Armored Core 6. Handler Walter. Okay. Uh, Diablo, various creature voices, uh, uh, Advance for 1 plus 2 reboot, Olaf, okay, oh, oh, hello, My Hero Academia, Endeavor. <laughs> what, what? This yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, he's a He's a voice actor, so it means he can change his voice quite a bit. Yeah, Don't speaking that, of... Hmm? Yeah, was it that experience where he, he did sound familiar? <laughs> yeah. Then we have this guy as Seven, Bows of the Virtuous, Fenric. Or Fenrish. What? Uh, Fenric? I know him, but I had the game! 
Oh, that's quite a voice change. Okay, I, person, that's a change too. I might, I might keep a note on this guy. This guy has flex. He's, he's like the opposite of Steve Blum, almost. <laughs> yeah, he, he has a bit more variation. Then we have Mortal Kombat Legends as Scorpion. Uh, Saints Row, various traditionals. A, a One Piece <laughs> film, Frankie. Wait, what? Is this this guy's the voice for Frankie in One Piece? Is, is it only in that movie or is he in more? Actually, now that I think about it, yeah, Blood Flag and Frankie's actually sound a bit alike. Uh, let's see, bunch of other stuff I don't recognize. Halo Infinite additional stuff. Hidden Megami Tensei 5. Metatron, okay. Star Wars Visions, he's in there somewhere. Uh, more S Scorpion and Endeavor stuff. Uh, let's see. Let's just do finding page again. One piece, was that a... F no, that was not a singular thing, it looks like. Yeah, <laughs> it's Frankie. It, it seem, he really does seem to be just the voice for Frankie from One Piece. I don't know who or, Frankie is. Wait, is Frankie the... The How big one with die? the metal nose. Uh, okay, so that his name is Frankie, okay. Yep. I haven't had a chance to see him in the show where... Again, I lost track where I was around 300, so I pulled prop it was probably way before seeing him. I have seen <laughs> images of him, so alright. Okay, it seems he did the voice at least from 2000 to 2013. And in just... Well, pretty much every movie from the looks of it, and seeing as that One Piece is still an ongoing thing, he might still be the voice actor, unless that's been changed now. The easiest way for me to find that out is to look up One Piece with the TV tropes that always lists, or usually lists, the voice actors. So, TV tropes, One Piece, okay, characters, now, let's see. Going to need to dig through like a mountain of sub pages on this, probably. Because there's just freaking thousands of characters in this. Uh, let's see. Actually, no, he's right there in the top first, of course. And again, he is a core character now. Um, yeah, Iron Man Frankie. Okay, let's see. Hey. Uh, yeah, Patrick Zeiss, uh, Zeitz, and let's see, hmm, okay, there's, there's three English voice actors listed here, Patrick, then Terry Dotty, D-O-T-Y, as Young, slash TV series, and then there is Greg Aries, A-Y-R-E-S, -E Young Unlimited Adventure. Is that like the most recent name or subtitle for it or something? Okay, so for a good long while he was the voice of Frankie. <laughs> okay. Holy. Okay, I, I, I think I might have a new... Uh, maybe not obscure, but lesser known voice actor. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Oh, God. Yeah, he, he sounds like someone who has quite a good talent. Yeah. <laughs> and this is still just going. Uh, oh, uh, what the heck? We might hit the end. We might hit uh, the, the. We might hit the next hour on this if this keeps going. But then again, THQ is slash was a massive company. I are they still around? I think they are. are. But they have been going downhill uh, a lot, apparently. Let's see, THQ... Uh, uh, THQ Inc. was... Were they taken up by someone? It's... I'm sure, but I don't, I don't know many fragments of THQ Nordic. 
between uh, the group that wanted to try to revive uh, Ray, Ray Sun Keen and many other ga old games, but they yeah. don't put in Kachu. Uh, let's see. Da -da 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 -da. <laughs> Traded as founded founder. Defunct since 2013, apparently. Okay. Who bought them up then, or who bought up the rights? Let's see. Da -da -da -da. Darksiders, The Blob, Destroy All Humans, Red Faction, Saints Row. Okay, so at the very least, their IPs are still reasonably active. Uh, let's see. Da -da 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 -da. Acquired. Okay, the THQ trademark was eventually acquired by developer Nordic Games. And most a good chunk of their. Okay, so the original THQ is no more, but it's now it now they are THQ Nordic. Oh. Okay, I thought it was just the Nordic branch, like a uh, Blizzard Nordic. Okay. And um, yep, yeah, THQ Nordic is still around. Let, let's see, what is no what what was Nordic about before THQ then? Uh but still going over here. <laughs> uh, let's see. Oh, they're, they're part of Embracer Group. Or they were taken over by Embracer. Uh, let's see. Embracer Group AB, formerly Nordic Games. And THQ Nordic. Okay, wait. Wait, is that a mer was that a merger or just a rename? I thought the Embracer Group were meant as a former TS2. So maybe they re-merged? No, no. The com... <clears throat> the company was established under the name Nordic Games. Okay, so it, it they started as Nordic Games, then t became THQ Nordic, and are now Embracer Group. Uh, let's right. see. Mm -hmm. yeah, I, I don't Jordan. know too much about Embracer Group. I do have mixed opinion. I mean, I'm glad they want to revive faithfully Lara Croft, Darksider, uh, Days of Kane, and many other old school games properly. But again, it, from what I heard, it seemed like it, the, they have gone a bit too. Well, too much of a big bite than they could chew. Yeah, they, they've been. They've been, from what I've heard, they've been spending too much on a, <clears throat> acquiring subsidiaries, and that has put them to the point where they're having trouble actually paying their subsidiaries. Yeah, again, mm -hmm. the goals were good, just maybe went for all the goals a little bit too fast. Maybe start with a few before go for the others. Okay, so THQ Nordic acquired Co Media Holding and Coffee Stain Holding from Coffee Stain Studios, like uh, Satisfactory and such. And, and their current subsidiaries are THQ Nor Nordic, as the, devel the developer studio still on that. Uh, Deep Silver. There's a bunch of names here that I don't know. Coffee Stain. And, okay, Based Coffee Stain around. and Ghost Ship Games. So right. <laughs> they own Deep Rock Galactic. Uh, wait. Yeah, wait. Coffee Stain all part of Valheim. Yeah. Saber Interactive, which includes 3D realms, like the old, uh, the old <laughs> boomer shooters in 3D realms. Uh, Gearbox Entertainment, so Borderlands as well. A bunch more names that I don't recognize. Dark Horse Media, as in from the comics and such. Uh, bunch more. Crystal Dynamics. Okay. <laughs> Again, a big PBA here. They really want to revive old franchises. Yes, probably is again. They quiet too many of them too fast. Yeah. <clears throat> they should hold them with a few, get the games rolling, get the money before starting the rest. Yeah. It's still going five minutes later. 
Okay, it might seem a bit disrespectful to be looking up stuff like this during the credits, but there's just so many freaking names that it just takes so bloody long. At least I try to pay attention for when the voice actors become uh, show up. Because, well, those are the most in direct interaction that you have with the, in the game, since, well, they voice all the characters. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> but, yeah. <clears throat> Once this is done, uh, we'll go look for someone to raid. And, yeah, next week we'll get started on the Space Marines story with this. And we'll see, well, we'll, ac we'll actually get some context as to what the fuck was happening during all of this, because Blood Flag never gave a damn about anything except kill this one jackass. <laughs> <laughs> Bloody, how much longer? <laughs> uh, yeah, after that, we'll have four more campaigns, or four more factions to take through the campaign, and we'll have to see in what order we go with them. Though I think, I, I think Vakir has a good suggestion for the first one. Well, of the Space Marines, we will go with them. Tyranids, the Nomnomers. <laughs> Yeah, just to see what the hell they do for interaction, because they're supposed to be a hive mind. <laughs> How are they going to have banter? Yeah, do again, hive mind is the most simplest term they can uh, explain it with. <laughs> so you maybe more advanced than the hive mind. Yeah, maybe more uh, hierarchy minds would be a better explanation of sorts. Yeah, but again, they have had very little time and a very hard time to research it. Yeah, especially since anything that tries to research them probably ends up dead. Yeah, only one has survived so far. And he's more of the exception to the rule. Let's see, anything interesting else here? Let's see... Blah, blah, uh, yeah, blah, blah, blah. He, I remember he could feel emotions from it, but he did say Number who did survive survive it well survived in with the mental well not going insane, very much said it's a truly alien mind. Mm -hmm. So yeah, mm -hmm. it's a bit of a good luck understanding it properly. Yeah. Let's see, apparently Embracer Group also owns uh, the Middle Earth games and such. So, Battle for Middle Earth and uh, the recent Shadow of Mordor and War ones. And that looks like it's finally the end of that. <laughs> uh, I might put a timer on Alienware. that. Is Alienware still a thing? I remember Alienware was the, supposed to be the best of the best. <laughs> and never met anyone owning an Alienware computer. Let's have a Google on that. <laughs> and... Okay, yeah, apparently they are still a thing. <laughs> okay. And yeah, that is the orgs done. And uh, no need for that. Next time... For the Emperor! <laughs> we'll be playing this game as <clears throat> the Space Marines. But for now, let's head on out over here and go look for someone to raid. So give me a second to move these where I can see them again. There and there. Okay, change the screen share, change windows, Twitch there. Okay, let's have a bit of a look. We have Pika who is playing Yakuza Zero. Okay. We have Jackson Sam who is playing Minecraft. They are playing the mod pack Stoneblock 2, apparently. Theory Pop is playing Small Saga. Not sure I've heard of that before, so let's take a peek. Everything is muted all the same. So no accidental uh, stealing of audio. And of course, there's a freaking ad. That damn car uh, ad let's again. See. Let's see. It looks like some sort of cafe or RPG. I, I think it's... Actually, no. Da, da, da. Okay, it, it's, it looks like an isometric RPG of some sort from the preview thing. Uh, next up, we have I'm Nice, who is playing Animal Crossing Horizons. I'm a flanker who is playing Crusader Kings 3. 
Coradust, who is playing Lethal Company. I've seen a bit more of that game now, and uh, well, it's uh, it's hilarious to watch and horrifying to play. Like, it's uh, if you mix <clears throat> if you mix a scavenger game with SCP Foundation. Okay. Uh Skipping the next two because art and cross codes. We have Sloop 2 playing Cult of the Lamb. Smoops on the Nonsense is playing Guild Wars 2. And last but not least, we have Halloween who is playing Alan Wake 2. I've been hearing a lot of good about this game, but I've not actually seen a, a thing about it to avoid spoilers and such. Okay. Can you plan to play it? Hmm, maybe. I've, I've seen a few plays... No, I've seen at least one playthrough of the game, and I've seen plenty of lore and theory f uh, videos about it as well. <clears throat> but, yeah, I... Maybe someday. We'd probably have to play for the first game <laughs> first, though, if we were to stream it. Oh, dear. <laughs> okay, wait... Okay, from uh, there's another streamer up here, a bit out of our typical range. Uh, Tear of Grace, who is playing Dredge, and the title is "What the Hell is Dredge Pale Reach?" So I, I'm guessing the DLC came out. Let me take a look. Or did he just get early access because uh, big YouTuber and streamer? Yep, apparently, Dave the Diver has a hot fix. Uh, let's see, Dredge. And, yep, the, D the DLC is out. Okay. <laughs> so, we'll have to take a look at that eventually. Maybe uh, next Spooktober. Uh, possibly. Okay. But for now, who shall we rate then? Oh, good question. Hmm. Uh... Oh, and I forgot to set the loop. I forgot to set the background music to loop. Oh, well. Uh, let's see. Slide pick. Uh, I guess we can take a corner dust. Okay. Just to see the shenanigans of that happening. So, there, copy the name. Then slash rates. Okay, but before we go, of course, uh, yes, let's see. No streams tomorrow because, well, Friday, free day. <clears throat> yep. And in, in the weekend, we can continue on with the Sexy Brutale and Enslaved Odyssey to the West. And if there is, if uh, Rom can't attend or can't join for uh, LA Noir on Sunday evening, uh, we can try it. We can try. Yeah, we can try a more chill stream <clears throat> with something like Planet Zoo or Jurassic World Evolution Two. We were to continue with that at some point. Yeah. <clears throat> now at this and... point, I think it's better to just start anew with that. Yeah. Do, I remember <laughs> we, we did speak about Minecraft and uh, Slime Rancher Two. Could pick those as well. Yeah. We, we could just pick which. You know, Maybe at random, or maybe whatever the hell we feel like. Yeah. <clears throat> but yeah, for now though, uh, thank you everyone who has watching now or later. Thank you Sensei for lurking. Thank you Pizza for <laughs> showing up and chatting along a bit. So hope you enjoyed the show. And thank you as always, Drakir. You're welcome as always, my friend. And thank you all for joining. And yeah, with that, let's get that raid started. And yeah. Until next time, uh, thank you all again for watching, and until then, have a nice day, and uh, until then. <laughs> Peace everyone, and watch out for undead seagulls. And orcs. And orcs. <laughs>